Welcome to the highlighter for Salesforce demo. We'll start out looking at an account. As you can see, there are two highlights on this account. The clean button and a phone number are both highlighted. If I switch over to the highlighter setup, you can see that there are several account and contact highlights configured. The first one is that green clean button. And if we go into the highlight, we can see that it is highlighted because the clean status field is not matched. In the same way, if we go into the phone highlight, the filters are set so that the phone is highlighted if it is blank. Now, you can also set up highlights that work without any filters. For example, we have taken out the parent account field always, with no filters. And in the same way, we have renamed the type field to category. As you can see, the parent account field is gone, and the field that used to be called type is now called category. If we scroll down to the contacts, we can see that in this case, there are two different fields, phone and email that are highlighted. Now, going back to the setup page, we can see those highlights but we can also see a red highlight for the email field. So why is this one not active? Well, going into the highlight, we can see that if the email is blank, but the mobile phone is not blank, that is when the highlight activates. So let's look at that in action. If I edit this contact and enter a mobile phone number, when I save it, the email is now going to highlight to a red color because of this particular business rule. Also on the page, we have a delete button that has been disabled. If we look at that highlight, we can see that the button is only disabled for all contacts where an email has not bounced. You are allowed to delete any contacts where the email bounced. Finally, we also changed the clone button to be called replicate. That's it. Don't hesitate to contact us if you have any questions or want a personalized demo. Thank you for watching.